Morning Prayer for Wednesday, January 3rd, 2024. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Eternal God, thank you for this beautiful day you've gifted me. Your love embraces my life, giving me the strength to rise once more and commence my activities under your watchful gaze. My life is marvelously touched by your presence, and I am in awe of the greatness of your love, my Lord. I pray that this day be filled with favor, allowing me to fulfill the aspirations in my mind and heart. I surrender my day entirely to you, offering you my heart and dreams. Take my projects in your holy hands and arrange them as you see fit. Guide me in choosing the right path and reveal the decisions I should make to become a better servant of yours each day. Father God, keep temptation and evil thoughts away from me. Grant me the strength to remain firm in my decisions and principles, and if I falter in any trial, bestow upon me the strength to recover and your merciful forgiveness. This morning, I lift up my family, their work, and studies to you. May they recognize that blessings come from your holy will, and may they be illuminated with your love and wisdom in their homes. Help us pray together, understand, and forgive when offenses arise among us. Bless their steps, protect them from the world's evils, grant them the strength to overcome tough times, and fill their hearts with joy to share in moments of happiness. Each new day is an opportunity to face the challenges that concern me. Every dawn, I seek your help to find the wisdom needed to provide the best solution. I trust, Almighty Lord, that I will triumph over this challenging situation and have another reason to glorify your holy name. I raise my eyes and prayers to you, thanking you infinitely for this new day. Be my guide and protector, ward off any evil that may come my way, and keep your watchful eye on me even in moments when I may stray. Grant me forgiveness and a path back to your heavenly abode, Father. I trust in you, blessed Father, that your grace will shower upon me this day, bringing much prosperity. I beseech heaven for your favor and request the outpouring of blessings on this morning that unfolds for me. All of this I pray in the mighty name of your Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Today's verse, 1 John 4, verse 15. If anyone acknowledges that Jesus is the Son of God, God lives in them and they in God. The verse from 1 John 4 verse 15 invites us into a profound acknowledgement of the divinity of Jesus as the Son of God. It lays the foundation for a transformative relationship where God dwells within those who confess this truth and, reciprocally, they abide in God. This affirmation is not merely a doctrinal statement, but a call to intimate communion. It urges us to recognize and confess Jesus not only with our lips, but with the entirety of our being, inviting God's presence to permeate our lives. In acknowledging Jesus as the Son of God, we enter into a profound union. It signifies a surrender of our hearts, a recognition that our lives are intertwined with the divine. This recognition transforms our perspective and guides our actions, for if God resides within us, our every thought, word, and deed becomes sacred. The verse prompts us to move beyond a superficial acknowledgement and invites us to live in the reality of this confession, allowing God's presence to shape our identity and influence our interactions. Moreover, the verse suggests a mutual indwelling, emphasizing the relational aspect of faith. God's presence is not distant or detached. It's an intimate, reciprocal relationship. As we confess our faith in Jesus, we enter into a communion where God's love, wisdom, and guidance become an integral part of our existence. This verse beckons us to reflect on the depth and significance of this divine connection, encouraging us to cultivate a conscious awareness of God's abiding presence in our lives. Dear Grace Wave family, as we conclude, let's unite in faith by commenting Amen if you believe in God and His Word. Your engagement strengthens our community. May the Lord continue to guide us in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. If you haven't, subscribe, like, and hit the bell for daily prayers. Your support is invaluable. God bless you, and remember, He is with us every step of the way. Amen.